Travelers who were once banned by major U.S. airlines for violating the federal mask mandate may soon be allowed to fly again. Four major U.S. airlines, Delta, United, American and Alaska Airlines, have announced they're now allowing some passengers who were once banned from flying on their planes due to mask violations to travel on board. This move comes after a federal judge in Florida on Monday ruled against the Biden administration's mandatory mask mandate for passengers on planes and other forms of public transportation. Airlines soon began lifting their mask policies for travelers. The cases will be determined on a case-by-case -case basis, depending on the company. Here's a rundown on where the airlines stand travelers who were banned for mask non-compliance will be allowed to purchase tickets and fly with the airline, a company spokesperson told NPR. However, the airline emphasized that some guests whose behavior was particularly egregious will remain banned from flying or purchasing tickets. Over the past two years, the company reported that more than 1,700 guests were banned for failing to comply with the federal mask policy. In a statement to NPR, American said passengers who are added to the company's no-fly list as a result of the mask non-compliance will be allowed to fly with American at some point in time. In cases where an incident may have started with face mask non-compliance and escalated into anything involved. Delta announced Wednesday it would reinstate flight privileges for travelers who were banned for violating the mask mandate. With masks now optional, Delta will restore flight privileges for customers on the mask non-compliance no-fly list only after each case is reviewed and each customer demonstrates. The Atlanta-based airline says that any further disregard for the new policies in place will result in placement on its permanent no-fly list. Customers who demonstrated egregious behavior and are already on the permanent no-fly list remain barred from flying with Delta, the company said. Southwest did not go into detail about how many people it banned for mask non-compliance, citing security protocols. However, the airline indicated that the travelers on the list were barred for disruptive behavior, and their status has not changed as of Thursday.